Hi there folks, I hope you're all safe and well. Um, this parcel has arrived uh, this morning um, and I thought it was something that I'd ordered because I've ordered a few things um, as many of us are doing. We're now doing our online shopping aren't we? Instead of because we can't pop to the shops. So I thought um, oh, I'll open that later. So when later came because I was um, at work, uh, working from home, uh, when later came I started to open it so I took off the, the outside wrapper and I was like oh, okay um, and then I opened the end and that is what I saw, tissue paper so I thought that's not what I've ordered <laughs> so I think it must be it must be something from um, from one of my lovely YouTube family so possibly one of my pocket letter swaps because I'm uh, I'm still doing the swaps and uh, I'm, I know I'm waiting a couple um, that people have said that they've posted so let's uh, let's get into it now so as soon as I opened that and realized I thought oh okay I'm rushing upstairs let's do this on camera so let's uh, let's see what we've got so I could I could open it, couldn't I? And it's something completely different, nothing to do with, with crafting or anything. And, uh, <laughs> oh, okay, so it's definitely something to do with crafting. Oh, okay. It's, yeah, all empty. So let's pop that to one side. So we have some tissues, not tissues, uh, napkins. So we'll put those there. We have, oh, look, very nice. We have some, um, yeah, pegs, little pegs with, oh, little wooden trees with um, buttons on. Oh, those are sweet. I like the way that uh, they've been displayed. It's a piece of card with a strip down the middle, stapled both ends. So there's a card. So let's see who this is from. So, there's something, oh, okay. Let's check with love. Happy mail. Oh, happy mail. Oh, lovely. Lovely cards. So, let's have a quick look. Oh, it's Abigail, handmade by Abigail. So, hello, Tree. So, I thought I would surprise you with my pocket letter because I already have your address. <laughs> <laughs> I also enclosed Christmas projects I'd left over from last year, my mini backpack and my tree pegs. Oh, are these online? Have you done a, a tutorial about them? I'll have to have a look. Um, and my tree pegs. I absolutely love Christmas. I've not taped anything up. Couldn't bear to put you through it. Lol. <laughs> Thanks, Abby. <laughs> really appreciate it happy crafting lots of love abby so handmade by abigail she's not been on youtube very long but she does at the moment she's in the middle of doing um uh i think is it, is it a card a day abby i think it more or less is there's, there's a, a whole profusion of them and i think i've watched most of them haven't had a chance to comment on all of them but they are absolutely gorgeous and she has a wicked sense of humor she's a a black country lass from uh uh i'm not sure exactly have i got your address abby i'm not sure i'll have to double check um but yes yeah, somewhere up in the black country not far from me in birmingham so yeah do pop along i'll put a link to her channel below um, so let's have a look. So we've we've had a look at the pegs. Those are lovely. Those are going to be really good for some of those uh, Christmas projects when I get to them. And the little backpack. I've seen these, um, seen these made up, and they are really sweet, aren't they? Nice little um, uh, idea for putting small little presents in. You know, a piece of jewellery, chocolates. <laughs> Oh, there is something inside. Let's let's pull that out of the way and have a look. So we have two little books. So are these part of the project, Abby? Is that what you did? Because it's the same paper, isn't it? So I guess these must have been gifts that you were sending out with a 
with a pencil, rubber on the end, always useful. In fact, those that can go straight in my pot. And we have, yes, yeah, a little belly band on the notebooks. And then inside, stapled, we have some lovely pages. So these are fabulous for making little notes and things. You could easily slip that into a pocket in your handbag or something, couldn't you? Good idea. I might keep those actually for my Christmas recce when I go shopping for Christmas presents. That would be really handy in a little, the two of them together. Pop them both into uh, the handbag with a list of who, maybe a page per person or a double page per person. That would be great, wouldn't it? So I'm very festive every time I pulled it out. So let's pop those back in because those are really cute. And we'll have a look and actually if, um, if you've got a tutorial on these, Abby, I'll link it straight to the tutorial. Uh, if not, I'll link it straight to the, the last um, card project that you uploaded. So let's pop that to one side and then get into, this feels like a pocket letter. Get all, so I've got pocket letters all on the side here <laughs> and they're all about to fall. Hold on one second. So loving this paper, absolutely stunning that I'm using at the moment. Let's pop that to one side. Don't want to lose it. Oh, there we go. And get in. And she hasn't taped it up, so that's fabulous. I don't have to mess and and faff and, and try to uh Oh, wow. Oh, look at that. Just to make you smile. Isn't that lovely? Let me just turn it around so you can see. I'll take the orange out. That might help. Might not, but it might help. So we have a very spring um, theme. with Lots of flowers and lots of beautiful background papers. Little deer and uh what's that badger absolutely beautiful lovely really bright and sunny oh has that fell off somewhere Ooh, okay what i'll do is i'll pop that to one side and oh it looks like it's snapped there or oh, i'm lucky i haven't lost any of the beads i don't think i have anyway i'll pop it to one side abby and i'll repair it after i've finished recording um but yeah on the top we've got um let me show you. We've got um, some organza ribbon, and then oh, it's one of those. What they call this? They use for sewing, aren't they? A sewers or a seamstress pin or something they're called. So that's uh, that's a good idea, isn't it? To hang that on there, yeah, because I could just take that off. Actually, that'll make repairing that easier. So I'm assuming it goes on there, there, Abby. Um, you must let me know whether it was there or whether it was in one of the pockets and then so we've got the beads those are gorgeous beads aren't they lovely big love that pink that kind of dusty pink it's gorgeous and then we've got some keys and a little heart on the side and that then is clipped onto the pocket using that little um seamstress pin let's pop that back on there, don't lose it. Uh, no, it wasn't through that one, was it? It was through that one. Put that back on there. It's a good idea. Because they're only tiny, aren't they? But they, they are. They will hold. So there we go. So that's the, the pocket letter. And then we've got the just, just to make you smile, which it has, Abby. It really has, because it's come as such a surprise. I must check if I haven't got your email, Abby. I'm going to email you and ask you for not email address. If I haven't got your address, I'm going to email you and I will get over a pocket letter to you as well. Oh, look, life is so much better when you're laughing. Oh, isn't that the truth? So we've got that. I mean, that's a lovely little topper on its own, isn't it? And then we've got some bling, some bling, lovely, actually bling will go in there i'll pop that in there because i haven't got any of those colors on my uh desktop this is um I'm sure it was lorna that made that for me i must go
go back and double check so I do usually keep things together because then I know where it's at but I do like my bling on the desktop because it just reminds me to use it and uh, it's within reach distance as well you also love like oh isn't that gorgeous with a beautiful little butterfly because his wings yes the wings all turn up as well oh that is so sweet and then we have oh so these are little banners aren't they so and you you've included the picks the toothpicks as well so these um yeah you make them up yourself don't you so you if i open them up i'll take one out so you often see them in cupcakes but you can use them for absolutely everything can't you you fold that in half like that and then you glue the banner with your um, toothpick in there and you make a little banner but you don't have to use them for that I could use them for all sorts of things actually those would be quite nice to go across you know when you do the folding technique let me show you uh, so I've been making lots of these that I then am putting on my my hearts across like that so those would be quite good to fold and put across a heart for a, a narrower one something like that instead so by the time you folded it and glued it it's only going to be about that length isn't it so that would be perfect for on there wrong colour <laughs> but you get the picture oh, those are going to be so useful yeah I've seen them in the shops and never actually bought any of those thinking oh well, you normally you stick them in a cupcake but actually once you've got them in your hands you start thinking oh I could use them like this or I could do them like that and actually those are really nice ones <laughs> that one's got cupcakes in but the rest are all little pieces of really bright colourful uh, paper to go with the the rest of the um, pocket letter there we go again I'm suffering from videos on so brain's not working <laughs> Let me pop that back in there keep them all together where did I put the sticks okay I know somebody's shouting at me they're there <laughs> let's pop that back in there with the rest of them there we go so and then in this one which is a beautiful um, little top and look at that oh look so it's a piece of card with some paper lace on there and a little um, little pot love it and some tiny little flowers that she's punched out and stuck on there that is absolutely I could see that on a card actually right on the front of a card with some nice background paper um, yeah that's the nice thing with this size isn't it you could put it on a, a card or something if you wanted to use them and then we've got some I have there's one thing I haven't got is crepe paper so and there's a couple of techniques I've seen recently that I thought mm, I wouldn't mind trying that but you need crepe paper so I might have a go at that um, if it's successful I might even do something a film or video it or something um, must go and have another look at it before I start thinking about that uh, let's pop that back in there oh I can see all the other <laughs> let's get to them so this one had lovely little um, little deer on it look at that lovely papers have they look and the colors are gorgeous really spring like and then we've got Happy birthday, all oh, lots of useful, very useful um, sayings and banners, aren't they? So always thinking of you, happy birthday, wishing happiness on your special day, best wishes. These are always so, so useful. So these will go in my little pot. And I've got a few of these type of things. I haven't got these ones, but a few of these types of things that will go in there. Um, keep them all together and that way 
when I'm in need of a happy birthday or something, I just go through my little pot and pull out whatever I think is relevant or the right size or colour or whatever. All oh, right, okay, so this is. Have you made that yourself? That's really cute. I haven't seen those little. Um, they're not buttons, are they? Little embellishment. I haven't seen those before, so you must let me know where they came from. So this one, we've got all those lovely little heart shapes. I don't want to get them out because they will escape. And then we've got, so that looks like a rose as well, can you see? Oh, I'm going to have to get one of them out because I, I haven't seen those before either. So let's get one out. Really. Is it picking it up? Yeah. Those are really nice. Glue those onto something. And that's similar to what you've used here, I think, isn't it? So she's made me up a little, tiny little envelope. And inside the envelope, we have, oh, look, <laughs> lots and lots of tiny little um, leaf sprays. Oh, wow. Well, I can see these being very, very useful. Oh, I, will keep, I have to keep them in that little pocket as well so I know where they are. I can see them being very, very useful. Is that a punch or a little die that you've got? That is really nice. Pop them back in there before I lose any of them. Carefully. And the envelope is tiny, isn't it? Look. Absolutely sweet. <laughs> I'm, I'm just besotted with tiny envelopes at the moment. I don't know why. And another piece of absolutely stunning papers. So pop those back in there along with the paper clip actually I'm going to leave those to one side because I can see myself struggling to get them in there and I don't want to pop off any of those lovely flowers so I'll pin that at the top and I'll come back and put them all in properly I don't want to lose anything or get anything damaged and then we have the gorgeous take those out as well we have the gorgeous badger in this absolutely this real dusty pink, that is it. And we have, oh look, little sunflowers. I've got one, two, three, four, five. Oh yeah. I do like these. I'm starting to use, I've got a lot of um, artificial flowers that I've collected and just never really used. I suppose I'm a bit like everybody else. We collect and we just in case or we have an idea. I don't know about anyone else but I have ideas when I pick something up going oh yes I'll do this this and this and then when I come and sit in the craft room I don't really do it. <laughs> I sit here going what can I do? Um, so, uh, um, which is why I'm going to take a little notebook and start putting um, notes in of what to do. So, uh, as I get the idea, because <laughs> otherwise I'll completely forget. So another little, gorgeous little topper. These flowers are gorgeous. I really like how you've done those, Abby. And then we've got, oh, she's given me some of those pins. Oh, thank you so much. Oh yes, I can use those on some of my um, my pocket letters now, can't I? Look, and then we have, I love these um, things, I've used, used them loads, I'm always looking for more. These little um, hinged key ring type things, so, and I haven't got any of those, so those are very, very welcome. So, pop those back in there, and these hinged um key ring whatever type things I, these are fabulous for when when i do my books i do some scrapbooks that i then give to family which i should actually look at doing some videos on but books take such a long time don't they and i mean i hate it i hate that my last video was um was in two parts but it's just the way my flipping camera on my phone did it 
I guess I was twittering on for far too long and it just went, eh, bad enough of that. <laughs> oh dear, let's pop that back in. Actually, I'm going to pop that to one side because that will go straight into the drawer with that. Okay. Oh, oh look, little, I love a little organza bag. Oh, and she's made them up for me. Oh, Abby, that's gorgeous. So there are some of those flowers some of those flowers there's a gorgeous butterfly and oh look and look at that how pretty is that butterfly absolutely beautiful such a lacy effect and then these pretty flowers is this a die or a punch i wonder that you've made up beautiful such pretty and these i absolutely love these flowers i don't know how you've made those but they are really pretty very effective i think with the pinched look isn't it so let's pop those back in and i love them again organza bag really do i'm not going to pop that back in because i will crush them um so i'll do that afterwards and again beautiful paper just lovely yeah i will push crush it if i try and put them back in and i don't want to do that so i'll do that when i've finished filming and then we have oh <laughs> little ladybirds i have a pack of these but you can never have too many ladybirds in your life can you oh that is really sweet <laughs> and again another beautiful um paper really nice oh and you've got your own stickers handmade by abigail that's the name of Abby's channel. Like I said, I will link it below and I'll see if I can find the video. Um, see if there's a video on the, your Christmas makes because those are really sweet. Let's pop that back in. So yeah, so that is a real surprise, Abby. Abby. Thank you so much for that. Please do pop over to Abby's channel and uh, have a look at some of the lovely makes that she's doing. She's a lovely lady. Um, always very upbeat and happy um, and gets very very excited <laughs> with things so yeah do go and see her and have a say hello from me and uh, yeah oh didn't really look at those did I look at those tissues with the um, kingfisher I love that green that's a lovely green so yeah do pop along and have a look and like i said she's making lots and lots of cards at the moment that that's a felt button isn't it a, a covered button that is yeah so do pop along and have a look at her channel um and uh yeah i will see you all next time so uh, yeah thank you oh and if you do want to join in with my pocket letter swap do give me uh, a call, an email, um, or pop your name below and uh, I'll give you my email. It's cbcrafter at yahoo.com. I've changed it because I kept losing the emails that come through my other email address. So I thought I'll have one that's just dedicated to the channel. It just makes life easier in finding the, the emails when they come through. So, yeah. Oh, fabulous. Thank you so, so much, Abby. That was such a such a surprise, but a very, very welcome one. And I love the fact that you didn't <laughs> stick down anything and you left me to open up, you, up the tissue without having to go through the pain of, <laughs> of ripping it. OK, take care, folks. Bye for now. Stay safe.